Okay, so in this video, I'm going to tell you how you can view the .cs proj file in your .NET project. So, if you have a solution and uh, there are going to be multiple projects in that solution, and for each project, the .cs uh, proj file is created. So, if you want to edit the .cs proj file for specific project, so you have to click uh, click on that project in the solution explorer. You can see here a solution explorer and uh, once you are in the solution explorer you have to right click on that project remember that you are right clicking on the project and not the solution this is my solution and this is my project so you have to right click on the project and by default it will uh, open the .cs proj file here you can see on the left hand side but if you can't see that you have to just right click on that project uh, that project name and click on edit project file so that is how you can uh, edit the .cs uh proj file you can see here dot cs proj file and each project uh, will have this uh, independent file dot cs proj file that is c sharp project file so what this file is basically about is it tells what is the target framework for this pro particular project so i'm targeting dot uh, net 5 that is the latest framework then there is a root a namespace that is the namespace uh, in which i'm gonna put all my classes and interfaces and whatnot after that is packable is false and then uh, this item group is there and in that uh, there is a package reference so this is very important basically uh, you can add all the dependencies that you need for example if you want to work on any unit project then you will need any unit dependency so you can put it in here and then after that you can click on uh, right click on this project and then click on restore or manage and nugget packages and then uh, what happens is that all those packages will be downloaded for you and it will be displayed in the dependencies package section on here over here so i have already installed these packages you can see this is the dot net uh, dot test sdk this is the one then any unit is the one then any unit three test adapter this is the one and there is a cover lid collector this is the one so these packages have been installed in this particular project thanks for watching this video